Hi, in this session I am going to show you how to create a form for the line item reports. So to create the form for the line item reports, you have to go to the FDI for the same transaction code for creating the balance display report or line item report, display balance report or line item report. So now I am choosing the form type as line item display. So now I entered the form name as ZFIR balance BL. Sorry, it's not a BL, so it will be line item. So I just put it LI0001. So now you enter the short description. <coughs> then you choose one axis with a key figure. Now click on create. So now the system will show this is the default uh, template for the form. So here you have key figures and this is the default uh, elements are four. So now how to add the element. So you just double click on the element here. So when you double click on the element there are two element types. One is a predefined element and another one is a key figure with a characteristics. So I am going to choose a key figure with a characteristic. And here you can see what are all the available key figures here you have to press F4 button here or you click on the drop down list so here the only difference for the line item and balance reports is balance report you have a balance carry forward and total debits total credits period balance and accumulated balance but here for this you have only key figure is amount in local currency so now in the columns I want to see by quarter so to see by quarter I choose posting period so to choose the posting period click on the period now after you select the period and right arrow then the period will appear here so now I am going to enter from is 1 and 2 is 3 and check and confirm or you can change the description so here if you don't enter any description it will show like this so I just put a first quarter so if I want to copy the same to other fields copy short text then it will be copied everywhere. And I repeat this what I can do here is now I will show you another option how to copy this so now I want to copy this and then just change it to the period from and to so to copy this you just select and then copy so if you see just copy it to the next row so now you double click on this and then four six so this will be my second quarter so I am going to change the short description also so second quarter copy the short text click OK and confirm so here I just put a first quarter so the description I just put as a first quarter form and the next one you want to copy both of them then you can select the block so if you select the block you can copy these two together so I just repeat the same step but I want to copy two together just copy so now you can see it was copied twice so double click and nine then this will be my third quote 
click confirm now I do for the fourth quarter also then and pop so here fourth quarter click confirm so now <coughs> I created all these quarters now I just want to put some formula so here I just want to add all these quarters so here click y01 plus this plus the third quarter plus fourth quarter just click ok now you need to enter total so confirm check so now you check so here in this the system is creating a program for the report so it says no errors found now I am going to choose general data selections here under general data selection I choose company code is my input parameter and physical here is my input parameter so these two are my input parameters so company code I choose as a variable and the physical layer is also my variable and check now confirm so now you can save so you have created a report so I just want to show you the other options here it is not only the period you can choose in the columns you have all the other options you can choose country in the columns you can choose a corporate group industry accounting clerk so all these are all available options so you want to do the some due date analysis yes you can enter the number of days so the system will automatically do this uh, aging analysis report for your local requirements so this is how you can create a form for the line item display